Online Update Service enables you to get the latest Access Manager product updates. The Upgrade Assistant feature simplifies the usage of this update service. This video demonstrates the usage of Upgrade Assistant feature for registering to Access Manager online updates and for updating devices to latest available released updates on both RHEL and SLES platforms. You can now upgrade all the Access Manager services using one click from the Primary Administration Console. On Administration Console Dashboard, click Upgrade Assistant. On RHEL system, you must create a local repository of Access Manager product. By default, Access Manager's repository, AM5.0 product, used for getting online updates will be enabled post-registration. And GPG check for Access Manager's repository is disabled. Specify Access Manager's local URL to which you want to register in the format mentioned. Click OK. For registering to MicroFocus Customer Center on SLES, ensure that you have obtained the activation code for Access Manager from MicroFocus Customer Center. Here for demonstration purpose we are using the sample registration key for SLES. Enter the email ID and the activation key in the respective fields and click OK. When a new Access Manager release is available, you can view the release details in available updates table. Here we can see there is one update. There are five notifications on the device status tab. Click device status to view various status of each device, such as whether the device is on the latest version or any update is pending. Here we see five devices namely, primary administration console, Access Gateway, Secondary Administration Console, Analytics Server, and Identity Server. This column displays the current version for each of the device type. This column displays the available versions for each device type. The Registration column displays option to either deregister or register each individual device. When Access Manager release updates are available for any of the devices, the update icon on device status page is enabled for the respective devices. Clicking on the update icon will start the update process in a new tab called Upgrade Console. You must update the primary administration console first and only then proceed with updating other devices. Click OK and proceed with updating primary administration console first. Click the highlighted icon to proceed with Primary Administration Console update. Read the alerts displayed and click Continue to proceed with updating the Primary Administration Console. You can see the upgrade logs for Administration Console registration in the Console Logs page. After a few minutes you can see the upgrade completed successfully message. The green icon against the Primary Administration Console Update Status column signifies that the device is up to date. You can save the console logs to your local machine for further reference. You can click Deregister if you want to deregister all the devices at a time. Click Yes to confirm deregistration. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you.